People who work in our hospitals are feeling the toll of the pandemic, especially right now, but they say they are still committed to their purpose. Fox 59's Courtney Spinelli has their message to you. Our hospitals are full. Uh, our healthcare workers are tired. Uh, and if there's one thing that keeps me up at night, uh, it's the uh, well-being of our um, staff. As positive COVID cases near the 200,000 mark, Indiana state leaders are highlighting the burdens of the pandemic. Perhaps some of the most sobering, the realities faced by healthcare workers each day. It is, to use one word, suffocating. It just feels like you can't interact with families. You can't give them the the sense of how severe the, the virus is. Officials say spikes in COVID-19 cases and staffing challenges remain major contributors. At IU Health, 89 patients are hospitalized with the virus or under investigation as 64 staff are quarantined. We're seeing the sickest of the sick, um, but uh, it's just devastating. Uh, and, and to see that disconnect between the community conversation uh, and some of the, the social distancing and the masking uh, is, is really tough. At Eskenazi Health, 35 patients hospitalized with COVID as 20 staffers are quarantined. But the fact that uh, many staff have already put in a lot of overtime and have stepped up and stepped in to care for these patients. So uh, there is, in some respects, a feeling that many people are worn out. Despite the challenges a pandemic presents. We all go into healthcare for a purpose, and that purpose is to help people and serve people, to make them well. So that purpose hasn't changed. Doctors say a second wave is here and they need the community's help to stop it from growing. Distancing, masking, hand washing and avoiding large gatherings. We, we know that some of this is preventable um, with, with some simple practices. Reporting in Indianapolis, I'm Courtney Spinelli, Fox 59 News.